Well, hey, it's Rob, and uh, today I'm going to talk to you about the only Rummy Cube set that you really want to own. So what do you have to be to be good at this game? Oh, simply smart, beautiful, and rich. Uh, no, I'm kidding. You need to be smart, you have to be, have a good memory, and you need, as always in life, a bit of luck. So you may have Rummy Cube in your house, if you know what it is at all. It's a game like Gin Rummy, except you play it with tiles, and your game probably looks like this. It all pays off at the end of the game when you win! Rummy Cube, it brings people together by Pressman. But this is not the one you want. The one you want is right here, and let's take a look at it. So this is the version of Rummy Cube that you want. It looks like airmail on the box, very cute, because of course it is imported from Israel, where it was developed in the 70s, became very popular there, and I assume people started to uh, bring it back when they went on trips to Israel. I just talked to my mom, and she doesn't know how we actually got a hold of it. We probably just bought it in a store as it was getting popular. So the current version of Rummy Cube that you might buy in a store that looks like a board game is junk. I'm just going to say it. The boards are flimsy. The tiles are thin. A lot of them have colors that make no sense, like red and orange that you can't tell apart. This is really the set that you want. And let me show you what's in here. If this was a guitar unboxing video, I would show you the case candy, which means it comes with couple extras, including uh, the Young America way to play Rummy Cube. So different rule sets. You obviously can play many different ways. Usually if you play as a family, you adopt a set of rules. And eventually you just use those rules every time you play a certain agreed upon set of rules. And there are different rules people come up with, like how you handle the jokers, how you do the initial meld, which is your initial run that you put down on board. Rummy Cube, of course, is a lot like Gin Rummy, just with tiles. Anyway, let me show you this fantastic set. Um, even the box is in good shape after 40 plus years. It's really amazing. And uh, I haven't done anything to keep it in good shape as we play this pretty often. Uh, we'll move the box out of the way here. And uh, oh, something else even stuck down here. Here's the instructions on how to build the racks. It really came with a lot of stuff, but what's really amazing about Rummy Cube is it's in this self-contained little box that uh, is like Russian nesting dolls. It's really amazing. It has this little lock here, and the lock holds in the game boards. And when you open it, of course, you are able to then slide your game boards out. You get two here on the top two here on the bottom and even the game boards are really nice high quality plastic they're really like a solid like some kind of composite plastic it doesn't bend it looks like it's like brushed or made of different materials of course you get this awesome looking rummy cube logo uh made in israel of course on one of these and right here is the storage for the legs of the rummy cube uh board I always play with this one because it's the coolest, of course. You simply lock the legs in like so. And away you go. There is your tile board right there. The tiles all fit in here very perfectly, like I said. Perfect fit. They just lay right in there flat. Along with these stands here that fit in and a little teeny bit of extra space. There's like no wasted space in this thing. Besides the game itself, which is a lot of fun. Just this thing itself and how it's put together, the quality of the materials, everything, it's really pretty amazing. So, of course, you got a bunch of tiles in here, and the tiles are like, a, you know, a deck of cards or whatever. They represent different colors, or different suits, and, uh, of course, different numbers. And the point of Rummy Cube, of course, is to either have uh, groups of numbers, I'm glad we got a joker there, that are either consecutive or that are um, the same number, but different colors. So you got your choice. Let me just throw a few on there. You start off with, uh, hey, there's a joker again. You start off with 12, 
and uh, let's see if we can get enough in here to get anything going just so I can quickly demonstrate how to play by the way these tiles are really good thick solid tiles they you know are just so much better than what you get today in a current set of rummy cube and like I said um, today you'll get like reds and oranges and you can't even tell them apart it's absolutely ridiculous all right so we've got a couple things in here now that I can work with when you play Rummy Cube, basically, you're looking for either uh, sets where you have the same number in different colors, of course, or you are looking for runs where you have the same color and consecutive number. The smallest set you can do is three. Of course, you can also add a joker wherever you want, wherever you like. You can't add it on your first move, or at least that's the way we play it. But basically, that's the idea of the game. It helps to have a uh, bag, and an old girlfriend taught me this. So take all the tiles, put them in. The best thing to put them in is like a Crown Royal bag. So these are all in a bag, separated, so they're not all over the table. Because otherwise, here's what you get. You're playing, and you get a bunch of tiles all over here. And then you're trying to fit your tiles that you're playing in the middle of the tiles that are already there. It becomes a big mess. Anyway, so basically, throw your uh, tiles in a bag, shake them up. You're going to draw tiles if you don't have a move to make. And you're going to put down sets on the board like this. And that is Rummy Cube. All right, without going into a whole tutorial, because that's not the point of this video, I just wanted to show you this awesome, cool set. Go on eBay. That's the place you want to go. Get yourself an Israeli set of Rummy Cube tiles from the 70s. It is the best way to play this game. Really, it just does not compare. There are lots of knockoffs and things like that. Rummy Cube, K-U-B, is the original, and this is the one you want to have. All right, that's it. See you later. Bye.